Hello, we are excited to announce a new update to Crowd Control that introduces comprehensive submission filtering capabilities. In doing so, our new submission search bar and preset filters are built to optimize the amount of time it takes you to find the submissions that you really care about. In this video, I'll go ahead and give you a quick walkthrough on how to utilize the new comprehensive submission filtering capabilities. Our new search bar now offers a simple to use drop down menu and suggestive search capabilities allowing you to easily select the filters that are best fit for you to find the exact submissions that you are looking for. To view the filter keys, simply click on the search bar and a filter key menu will drop down. To select a filter, simply click on the filter key that you wish to apply. In this instance, we will go ahead and filter by the submission state and more specifically by those submissions that are in a resolve state. This will give you a view of all the submission vulnerabilities that you've submitted and have been fixed by the respected security teams. What's great about this search bar is that you can actually choose to enter filters without raising a single finger from the keyboard by simply entering the filter key followed by a colon and then the value. For example, I'll go ahead and choose submission state again and filter by those that are in a unresolved state. In this instance, state would be the filter key and unresolved would be the value. As I said, without lifting a single finger from the keyboard, you have the ability to really refine the search as much as you like by continuing to apply filters in the search bar, such as, let's go with the submission of Severity 2 and those that have not received a payment yet. In doing so, you can easily track your accepted submissions that have yet to get paid. Our goal here is to allow you to tailor your search as much as you'd like to find those specific submissions that you are looking for. So in addition to applying multiple filters, you can also find submissions by searching keywords. For example, I'll go ahead and enter in JSON, and you'll see here that in the title of the submission, the keyword JSON is present. Above the search bar are preset filters. These filters were built to allow you to easily view submissions in different stages of the life cycle. These preset filters auto-fill the search bar with the filter key and values specific to the different stages of the submission lifecycle. For example, simply click on the preset filter labeled pending to view all of your submissions that have yet to get accepted by the security teams. For a better understanding of this new update, please take a look at our crowd control documentation.